Today I am going to show you how to create a login screen and get OTP verified in Flutterflow. So first of all we go to flutterflow.io. If you are new you can sign up and log into your account. So here are some of my projects. Let's create a new one. Login demo. Okay. I create I'm creating a blank project. Okay. So here we are now. Uh, we will go we are going to create a new page. Login. And in this, we're going to search like I'm going to use login with phone number. So this is the template I'm going to use. Login page, create the page and we will require one more page. That is for OTP verification. This one. So this one is OTP verify. Create the page. Okay. And OTP would be of six. Let's so six. Now we have to. Uh, give the authentication enable authentication firebase and entry page is the login page and logged in page is the home page now it's saying that firebase is not set up so let's go to firebase.com firebase.google.com here you have to log in with your gmail account if you are already logged in just go to the console create a new project so our is login demo so i am creating that project in analytics you can say login demo So like your country in this analytics so our project is ready now just click on continue in this project project settings you will get a project id copy this project id to here but it will not work because we have to give uh, flutter flow the permissions to access our firebase so we just go look down there and yeah this is the one flutterflow.io in this you go in users and permissions add member email address and role to be the editor and then add member Now go to our flutter flow and now we will click connect and it will here the firebase setup is complete now authentication for this uh, we are going to enable the authentication and get started in the firebase we need to enable the phone number login yes save okay now we are going back to the login page here it will show the error phone number or property not set so in this we just select the widgets tree uh, available options and the other one is uh, 
okay so we select the otp verify page then when we click on the confirm pin code add action on completed we are searching for authentication thing and verify the sms code now in this we select the widget state and available option is pin code so here you will see that green okay now we are going to run the project it will open a new tab with the project running You just have to wait for a few seconds for it to get loaded. okay so here we are authentication sign in method here we have the option to add testing numbers 91 and otp is one two three four five now i click add okay so it's added now let's test in this one One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, here we are. Now the person is logged in. Now I will reload it. It will directly open the logged in page since we are logged in. See? Simple. 